instead of using glue like I did before I've cut out some uh, perspex pieces with grooves which are 5mm apart it's not exact but it's the best I can do with what I've got um, yeah so I've put them in there one this side one this side I've glued it with aerodite and uh, once that dries I'll do the other side as well so it should all be equally spaced As you can see, it's uh, I've glued both sides now. I'm just waiting for the top one to dry now, and uh, I'll be going to bed in a moment, so that should be dry for the morning. Here's the distilled water. It's a bit murky. That's from the uh, the white glue that we had in there before. So this is what I'll be using for my tests and I'll probably I'll put that back on the top um, have the wires rooted and coming out the side and get a pipe coming out the top so I can measure you know how much HHO is produced See you tomorrow. Hello. Well, this is it. The glue's dried. You can see it's the spacing isn't too bad. It's not brilliant, but again, not too bad. I chopped off half of the. Uh, perspex that was coming out because it wouldn't have fit in the bottles or anything hopefully we'll be able to test it later um, I've got my grandparents coming to stay over the weekend so I'm not sure how much time we'll get for this but I'll try and uh, do as much as I can See you later. Hello, welcome to experiment number 12. I've got the new cell in here. Seven, yep, meter. I still can't get yeah. working. So I've turned it off. Volts. Stopwatch. Measuring jobs. Yeah, as you can hear, I'm joined by my son Ollie and my granddad Pete's here with me. And, uh, we're not going to measure it to begin with. We'll just turn it on and see what happens. Here we go. Switched on, 14.12 volts. It's making HHO gas. It only seems to be coming from those plates though. plates on one side only you see in the top there all the bubbles coming out Yeah, you watch this, Ollie. We we'll see how fast we can get it to go. This is 500 mil milliliters. I can see it. In this, uh, this bottle, the measuring bottle. So we're going to start it. I 
good. Now. So we'll see how long it takes for the bottle to come out the water and to fill up with the gas. And there's stones. Stones, yeah. Stones, yeah. You want your shoes on. Well, I've just realised that there must be a leak. It's not filling up. It's uh, so this bottle I don't think is airtight. So there's a leak somewhere. End of experiment.